Fun fact, I've never been to Canada in my entire life. O'Hare International Airport. I don't think I've been here either. I've been to Chicago plenty of times, but I think I've driven every time. Honestly, I don't even know. Maybe I have. All airports start to look the same after a while, except for LAX and Detroit. And for whatever reason, those are the ones that stand out in my mind. I'm just hoping this place has good food. So I ended up going with the only thing that I could find that had vegetables in it. And if you can see here, they actually charge you an extra 80 cents for vegetables. And it's 80 cents, it's not like it really matters, but it's just a principle, man. We're supposed to be making vegetables cool and they're over here charging people more for them? Man. Running through the six with my woes. Count money, you know how it goes. Hey, what's up, guys? Uh, Brandon Harding. Street. What's your just do Drive yourself yeah. promo? <laughs> My channel is Brandon Harding. We're just here on the way to the villa right now. This isn't really our place. She's just like breaking in. Awesome. <laughs> yeah. yeah. The door's not working. Yeah. This isn't our place. <laughs> right. It's raining. Let's go. We broke in. <laughs> we made it. <laughs> oh. Guys, this is the most rich homie place I think I've ever seen in my life. We got Nemo and Dory together. This is unreal. what is that? This really does feel like a movie. <gasps> Have you seen the fish? <laughs> Dory and Nemo. We've got to feed them every day. Okay. It's like part of the room. Nuh-uh. Yeah. We get to feed the fish? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> but if we put our extra clothes and the fish, we've got to feed. Yeah. That's food. awesome. And, uh, what in the world? Is this an office? Yeah. Wow. Wow. Oh, this is so cool. This is unreal. Whoa. This looks like something out of a futuristic movie. What the hell? No lie? This is the nicest house I think I've ever stepped foot in. This, I mean, this, have you ever seen Fresh Prince of Bel-Air? I pulled up to the house about seven or eight and I yelled to the cabbie, yo home, smell you later. This is how I feel right now. Look at this neighborhood, guys. Like so many rich homies all around this place. Unbelievable. I wanna get to your clothes, gotta get it right now I wanna push all the limits with you right now So watch your feelings, the city screaming when I'm coming home tonight We're living quick in the world, gotta get it right now People talk and tell what you wanna hear now Recording you record, the eggs, the shopping This is like the typical fitness grocery pickup right now We better stick together, let's come whatever when I come in home tonight. We're living quick in the world, gotta get it right now. This is insane. Everyone watching right now better thank these lovely ladies for dinner. This is amazing. Thank you guys. I need to figure out how to wrap it because I think I feel it. There's no way I'm gonna be able to wrap this. No, I might just like. It's gonna be more like a taco. Sorry. I'm pretending to understand what they're saying. Come on. The PE science, cheating on BPI. 30% link in description. And number. Look at that pour. Two. That perfect that like pour. Precision. In and measurements. I knew you use those biceps or something. Bro, should be okay. Is it good? That is delicious. You good? This is one of the best meals I've ever had with the peanut butter and the oatmeal in there. Yeah. That's awesome. And of course, 
the PS Select. How awesome is that? But it has been a long day. It's been a fun day. But I gotta get some sleep. Expo day one. City overseas, couldn't do this on my own. I knew I would need the team. Dreams get dreamt when the lights turn low. But the grass ain't green where the lights don't show. This is like all I want for Christmas for the rest of my life. Give the things about cool. I'm always my content. Rise is hooking it up. We got the Team Rise shirts. We got the camera over here. Yeah, this is this is sick. Look at these performance shirts, man. Yeah, that's nice. On the ground to the piece you found. Record pieces on myself. This a piece right now. Pretty dope setup here, guys. We got the booth. We got the stage over here. This is I don't know what I was expecting. It's kind of a mix between the Arnold and the LA Fit Expo. It just feels like a good size for a fitness expo. Welcome to the mighty. Travis S. Expo. Danny got fit. People gonna come and try to knock you down. Rather see you hurt laying on the ground. But when they try and tell you no, remember anything is possible. Anything is possible. Remember anything is possible. So we come all the way to Canada, and what do we eat? <laughs> of course, Chipotle. The most American thing you can think of. I'm blaming Jeff. We should have gone to Tim Hortons. Yeah. Tim's? So much better. Do you have Tim Hortons in Ohio? Yeah. 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 I smell a lot of cannabis right now. Look who I found. A wild Riley DeVoe. Previously the Black Dog Fitness. Now he's the very white fitness type. Just switch it up. Back at the expo. We got our coffee. We're feeling good. How you feeling? How are you liking the expo? I'm having fun. Is Rise the nice best food here? Rise is the best food here. Besides Rise of PS, of course. I haven't been to the PS booth, but I'm sure it's awesome. All right, guys, so we're back at the expo, and I have to say, Canadians are the nicest people ever, all right? I love it here. This expo has been amazing, and I cannot thank you guys enough for all these opportunities that you present me. Deep in the morning, if I'm gone one day, hope I do come back to you. Hope one day I stay. You know I think you. What'd you guys think about the expo? Oh, it was amazing. It was How wonderful time. I didn't even know if he was, bro. Man. It was all, all I'm gonna say is Team Rise crushed it. Uh, Dude, this chili is amazing. This is so good. Because like, I eat a lot of food and there's yeah. no way that my body actually consumes it all. But I feel like in order to gain size, I feel like I need to. Your body probably does consume it all. I mean, like, you have a huge capacity for absorbing calories. You probably just burn through more than you realize. Yeah. You're probably really, really active. You probably yeah. have a huge energy expenditure. So that's probably what you mean. Your body's not storing it all, it's burning a lot of it. But it's all getting, it's all going in your mouth. If I was storing everything I ate, I'd <laughs> it's all going in your mouth, Brandon. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I think that like for a guy like you, you're young, you have like a lot of muscle, huge energy expenditure, like your training and everything is gonna be better if you just have that huge food intake. And I think that being overly anal about tracking it isn't, isn't gonna benefit you. Yeah. you don't I'm assuming you don't you're not tracking this. <laughs> what do you think about tracking when you're traveling or when you're at a special event or something like that? I mean, I, I think it's a good skill to have, like especially if you're cutting or you know, if, especially if you're in contest prep or something like that. But I don't do it personally. I think that you know, if you have generally good nutrition skills, eating habits, then it's not really necessary. I try to eat higher protein quite regularly. Focus on like good nutritious foods. Like Bran is a good example. Yeah. <laughs> cinnamon rolls and cinnamon dust crunch. <laughs> He, he literally just said, like, this is so good, I'm actually completely stuffed, but I just, I just want to eat it. That's, that's what you want to do. <laughs> you ready for this? Late night workout? Late night workout. Getting it done no matter what. He knows how to rap on yeah. heavy stuff, he just never does. It's this new album that... How 
How you feel, man? It's weird, man, working out this late. Yeah. It's so different. It's tough. I'm not used to it. Nice, man. I think I just need to accept the fact that I'm just not going to sleep tonight. Full day. It, it, it? I'm gonna put a shirt on. I feel like a, a bit of a douche. You feel no. better now? Yeah, I'm better. You good? Yeah, it's good now. <laughs> All right, guys. So I know you just kind of saw like a hodgepodge of stuff. I'm coming to Toronto for the expo. You guys know how I feel about expo footage. It's very boring. So I wanted to make this a little bit different. So we took you through like a full day of eating, and I think what you'll notice is that we don't eat like that much differently than the normal no. population. I yeah. mean, when you're exposed, you have crap like protein bars and stuff. And yeah. You kind of do the best that you can, right? You, yeah. you make the best with what you have. But overall, it's it's just the normal everyday foods. And I think yeah. I think the issue that I, sure. see, I see the most time is like people get so caught up in that stereotype of the old school bodybuilders. And okay, they're like, yeah. all you eat is chicken, rice, and broccoli. That's the not only- even, Okay, not even just that. Not even like old school bodybuilders, but- <laughs> I feel like when people see people on social media, they see like, oh my God, they look like this on Instagram. They look like, I wonder, like they must be so motivated. They must be, they must eat nothing but chicken and rice every single day. Yeah. When that's so not the case. I mean, I know an expo is like sometimes for most people, like a once a year thing. But also keep in mind, it's more than just expos. It's holidays, it's parties. It's a lot of other life events, right? Yeah. And I think people, for sure. they need to focus more on living life. Like if you were just so focused on eating certain foods, you wouldn't be able to go out and do certain things and, and meet cool people, you know? Exactly. And like with the expo and everything that we just like, we literally just had like a two day expo and we had nothing but protein bars and protein cookies and all these sort of things and everything. But Although that seems like, okay, we only fell off our diet because it was an expo. Um, there are other opportunities like all throughout the year and stuff where you can't stick on your diet. Like, I feel like mm. with this whole fitness journey and everything, as long as you're doing something every single day to pursue that goal, enjoying life at the same time makes this like what it is. It's about like pursuing a goal, growing physically and mentally. Yeah. And if you're so caught up on like beating yourself up about like, I didn't do this today. I fell off my diet today. You need to like find a balance and enjoy yourself as well. So like us going for the expo today, and eating the protein cookies. That's not, I'm not gonna lose sleep over that. Like I enjoyed my life and I enjoyed my day and like we had such a good so two days. Fun, like, and so much fun, like, it's dude. Been, it's been so sick. There's more important like, things to life, right? Yeah, there's more important things to life than like, just being so strict. And uh, and like you're a competitive bodybuilder. You just competed in your first show, right? It looked yeah. amazing, right? I'm and you still it. went out and lived your life. Yeah. And, and so I would say exactly. you're, you're a great example of how a more realistic approach to this whole lifestyle works. So that's kind of the message that we wanted to portray in this video. Yeah. I think really the last thing we want to do is just give a huge shout out to Rise, man. We, we came in, we didn't this even is, know yeah. each other. Yeah. Like, I didn't, I mean, I knew we, you yeah, from we, Instagram yeah, we, we and YouTube. We searched Instagram and YouTube and everything, but like, that's it. because of Rise, We've had the opportunity to like meet and stuff, and this guy, like honestly, like, this guy's a bro for life. Like this is the opportunity, the fact that Rise has like created this like opportunity to meet the people that we're on this team with. Like it's hard to get over the fact that we didn't know each other like in person <laughs> two days ago, and now we're like we're all as close as we are like a team. Like the workout that we did last night and everything, we're like working Epic. out with like bros and stuff that you've known for like years and years. Like it's the fact that like Rise has created this opportunity for us. Crazy man, and to be in this place is it's nuts, an insane. This is so like, like the yeah. nicest place I've ever been in, and it's just like they've created this um, this atmosphere, and it's just it's just a great company to be working yeah. for, man. I'm very blessed, and I think um, yeah. I think one of the things that you'll notice is it's just the people on the team. You guys have already seen Jeff and Stephanie on the channel. Obviously, Mark and Kath are amazing, and I really want you guys to go over check out Brandon's channel. He just completed the 10,000 calorie yeah. challenge only eating cereal. This dude is obviously <laughs> a beast. I mean, you see his physique, that speaks for itself, but he has great content. His positivity Benjamin. is just on point. And guys, I want you to keep in mind, this dude is 20 years old. So if you guys are looking for any inspiration, any type of it, I mean, the, the guy has everything on his channel. So please, it'll be the first link down below. Please go check it out, guys. Brandon, it's been a pleasure, man. It's been a blast. I can't wait till we do it again. Yeah. We still got a few days here, but we're gonna cut this video off right now. I just wanna thank you guys so how much many, for how taking many the time. More days? Like three more days. We have like, okay, we have tomorrow, then the death, and then you leave the Tuesday morning. Tuesday morning. So we okay. have tonight and tomorrow. But it's gonna be lit. It's gonna be so sick. It's gonna be lit, bro. It's gonna be sick. It's gonna be lit. That's what you always say. It's gonna be lit, bro. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. We're gonna check out Eat Some Sushi. Thank you so much for taking the time. Add your day to watch. Go subscribe to Brandon. Thank you again to Team Rise, man. It was amazing. Thank you to everyone that came out. Love you guys. Look forward to talking to you next time. Oh, I'm so bad at this. No, we, we, okay, we go again. Go you, again. you feel good? You feel better with the shirt on? Just like, <laughs> act as if we're like, <laughs> like, got the sushi, bro. Yeah, it's sushi.